Okay, guys, it is the depths of winter and one little walk into a compost heated greenhouse. And it's like we're in Southern California in Utah. We'll go back out, take a look again. <laughs> the depths of winter, folks, take a look at that. The depths of winter and we'll walk in again. And it's like Southern California. There's no services on this property. There's no heaters or anything. This is the way it is. It's unbelievable. It is so beautiful, nice. All right, it is now time for yet another video where I get tortured. This time we're gonna go to the Ogden farm in the snow and we're gonna take a look at my citrus. Follow me. All right, it is a cold winter's day at the Ogden farm and we are gonna go out and show you our citrus. Let's take a look at it. Teens last night and six inches of snow on the ground. Let's see how our citrus looks. Follow me. All right, as we go out and take a look at our citrus, it's gonna be a little bit fun to do on the camera because there's a lot of snow and I gotta keep my eyes a little bit on the ground because I don't wanna fall into a hole here. We have ditches, we have five feet of mulch over here. It goes way up to our greenhouse. Take a look at this, folks. I am going up in the air at our farm. We have a hill built around our greenhouses. We get 90 or 80 mile, sorry, 80 mile an hour winds. And I gotta be careful I don't go off the cliff here. So let's turn the, zoom the camera around really slow. Okay, all right, there's no cliff, okay. <laughs> I'm going uphill, six foot high mound of wood chips. <laughs> And here is our greenhouse covered in snow. So we're gonna take a look and go inside of it and see how our citrus looks. Let's go around in a circle. This is an absolutely beautiful farm in Ogden. It's all under wood chips. So it means we don't have to weed water very much or till any longer. In the van is my 20 year old dog Jigs and we're gonna do a live stream on TikTok here. So maybe some of you will see us. If you do, let us know. So we're on this wood chip pile, lots of snow. Let's go take a look in our greenhouse. All right, let's go walk towards it really carefully. Do not want to fall down. <laughs> All right, guys. It's a lot of fun doing this. This is part of the original Fars Orchard in Ogden. So it's been farmed since the 1850s. Behind me is an original tree that came with the property. And that pear tree came with the property. Look how tall it is. It's about 35 feet tall. It has tons of pears. When the pears produce, it looks like a Christmas tree. All these trees behind me were just planted five to six years ago and they're full size, humongous trees. This orchard has six feet of topsoil. It produces like nothing I've ever grown on or seen ever. My dad loved it. So let's go walk in the greenhouse. Follow me. So we're gonna do this whole video on one take. So you're gonna get to see the whole thing live pretty much as it is. Okay, let's take all the clamps off. So we had really aggressive winds here the other day. And the people that were on my farm tour had to see this, including the guy that looked like Wilson on Home Improvement. I hope he's watching this video and he can say hi to us. What a good sport and he was a lot of fun and very smart. He's gonna help us build a walk-in cooler. So as we zoom out, we have wood chips around this greenhouse. Inside the plastic, you can see compost. Straw bells that are decomposing in the plastic. Okay, tons of them. We also have about 60 bags of leaves in between layers of plastic. And you can't see it because of the snow, but there's wood chips. So we're holding in a lot of heat and a lot of things that are going on here. So there's a lot of processes going on in this greenhouse. A lot of things giving out heat, holding in the heat, and keeping it so the wind doesn't ruin it. Let's go inside and see how everything looks. Follow me. Okay, so 20 year old Jigs is in the van. He's real happy. We're gonna let you guys see him. Let's go inside. Every time I go in here, I am blown away. Look at this, folks. It is absolutely amazing in here. I will try not to fall over. 
zoom out a little bit. Wow, look how pretty it is. And the sun's out. I mean, the trees are humongous. They go clear up to the roof. And they grow out of the, they grow out of the windows, actually, when we open the windows up to ventilate it. But not many of you know that we actually started this out with fig trees and pomegranate trees. And they took over, so I had to chop them down, but there's huge trunks. Let's go take a look. So this is the first time we've ever had lemons on a tree and they are ripening up really, really nice. Take a look at this. First time this tree's ever produced lemons. And there are some massive grapefruit in here. Take a look at these pomelos. And as we take the camera out a little bit and go over here, there's more pomelos, Utah grown, humongous. There's one hiding back there. There's tons of fruit in here, folks. So this greenhouse has an A-frame built inside of it out of redwood. This thing is never going to move anywhere. Okay, so it looks like a high tunnel, but we've actually enforced it big time. Because I'm a crazy mad scientist farmer, and in between the plastic layers, I like to put things like wood chips. I can see the light. Whoa, take a look behind me, folks. There is the light. I have not died and gone to heaven. This is Ogden, Utah, and that light is the outdoors. <laughs> and it's... It's cold out there, but inside here, Southern California, without any heaters or any services, really cool. This is a perfect place for 20 year old Jigs and me to hang out. Look how nice and warm it is in here. 20 year old Jigs could not be happier and he's with me right now at our Ogden farm. These are the biggest citrus trees in the Intermountain West. No services on this property whatsoever. There's a Tangelo tree. We wish you all a great day and we'll see you on our next video.